Island News Midday Update is sponsored by Soldier to Soldier Hawaii Realty. Happy Wednesday, Hawaii. I'm Lindsay Fukano with your Island News Midday Update. New at midday expects some major traffic backups in Kalihi due to an extensive water main break. Here's new video of the intersection of Waikamila Road and Dillingham Boulevard. Crews from the Board of Water Supply are working to repair a 12-inch water main break, and those repairs could last through the rest of the day. And this is video we took of the scene earlier this morning. And those repairs, again, they could last for a while, so drivers can either take Kalihi Street, King Street, or Nimitz going westbound to avoid that mess. Congresswoman Tulsi Gabbard introduces a bill today to expose taxpayer-funded sexual harassment settlements in Congress. And Gabbard recently co-sponsored the Me Too Act to prevent sexual harassment in Congress and provide justice for victims. Gabbard will be voting today on legislation to require all members and employees of the House House to complete sexual harassment training. For the latest on sexual harassment in Hawaii, watch Island News tonight at 5, 6, and 10. Honolulu police are looking for two men who allegedly robbed Long's drugs in Mo'ili'ili using a very bizarre weapon. And according to police, one of the suspects shot an employee with a slingshot. That happened around 1 in the morning, October 24th. So if you recognize either suspect, you are asked to call Honolulu police. The city's planning committee will hold a public meeting tonight to discuss land development in Le'ie. Hawaii Reserves will present an alternative to the Envision Le'ie plan. The land management company has been trying to push their 300-acre proposal to build hundreds of homes and commercial development. The Honolulu City Council's planning committee is holding that public meeting tonight at 6.30 at Haula Elementary. As always, don't forget to tune into Island News tonight at 5, 6, and 10. Have a great day.